Hey, it's Mark from Quiz Heroes here and welcome to this week's quiz. This week's quiz is the ultimate quiz challenge. We have four different categories for you and 40 challenging questions. This week's categories are song covers, famous landmarks, history and general trivia. And here comes the first round, song covers. And here's question number one. Cindy Lauper had a number two hit in the US Billboard charts in the 1980s with Girls Just Want to Have Fun. But who recorded the original demo version? Peter Godwin, Robert Hazard or C. Farrow? And the answer was Robert Hazard. Here's question number two. In 1976, Rod Stewart released his hit song, The First Cut is the Deepest. But which famous singer-songwriter originally wrote this song? Was it Donovan, Neil Young or Cat Stevens? And the answer was Cat Stevens. Question number three. Johnny Cash originally released his hit song, Ring of Fire, in 1967. But who released the original recording? Was it Anita Carter, Connie Smith or Kitty Wells? And the answer was Anita Carter. Question number four. UB40 had a hit song in the UK with Red Red Wine. However, the song originally appeared on the second album of which famous top US singer? Was it Barry Manilow, Neil Diamond or Billy Joel? It was, of course, Neil Diamond. Question number five. Blondie released their top hit record, The Tide Is High, in 1980. But which band originally recorded this song 14 years earlier? Was it the Paragons, the Jamaicans or the Melodians? And the answer is the Paragons. Question number six. Mark Ronson and Amy Winehouse had a massive hit with Valerie in 2007. But who recorded the original version in 2006? Was it the Vamps, the Zootons or the Happy Mondays? And it was the Zootons. Question number seven. The Pussycat Dolls had a massive hit in 2005 with Don't You? But who released the original version a year earlier? Was it Nicole Ray, Kylie Dean or Tori Alamez? And the answer was Tori Alamaze. Question number eight. Florence and the Machine released their version of You've Got the Love in 2009. But who recorded the original in 1986? Was it Aretha Franklin, Candy Statton or Laura Lee? And the answer was Candy Statton. Question number nine. Tainted Love was covered by both Marilyn Manson in 2001 and Soft Cell in the 1980s. But who recorded the original? Was it Gloria Jones, Fontella Bass or Clyde King? And the answer was Gloria Jones. And the final question of this round, question number 10. Leona Lewis had a huge hit with Run in 2008, but who recorded and released the original in 2003? Was it Coldplay, Snow Patrol or the Arctic Monkeys? And the answer was Snow Patrol. Let's move on to round number two. Round number two is the history round. And here comes the first question. Tutankhamun's tomb was famously discovered in 1922. But what was the name of the archaeologist who discovered it? Was it Leonard Woolley, Howard Carter or Arthur Evans? And the answer was Howard Carter. Question number 12. Which one of King Henry VIII's six wives was the only one to receive a Queen's funeral? Was it Anne Boleyn, Catherine Howard or Jane Seymour? And the answer was Jane Seymour. Question 13. Who was the second president of the United States? Was it George Washington, John Adams or Abraham Lincoln? And the answer was John Adams. Question number 14. During World War II, the battles of El Alamein took place in which country? Was it Egypt, Turkey or Iraq?
And the answer was Egypt. Let's move on to question 15. In which year was the Magna Carta signed? Was it 1216, 1214 or 1215? And the answer was 1215. Question number 16. In 2010, Colin Firth starred in the film A King's Speech. The film was about a British king who suffered with a speech impediment. But which king was this? Was it King Edward II, King George VI or King Charles II? And the answer was King George VI. Question number 17. The Titanic famously hit an iceberg and sank in 1912. But who discovered the wreckage? Was it Robert Ballard, George Bass or Keith Muckleroy? And the answer is Robert Ballard. Question 18. Leonardo DiCaprio played the lead role in the film The Revenant in 2015. But which real-life American frontiersman did he play? Was it Jebediah Smith, Kit Carson or Hugh Glass? And the answer was Hugh Glass. Question number 19. In which year did the Challenger Space Shuttle disaster take place? Was it 1986, 1985 or 1984? And the answer is 1986. And the final question of this round. Question 20. What was the name of the pilot who famously fought in the Battle of Britain with two artificial legs. Was it Eric Locke, Douglas Bader, or Brian Lane? And the answer was Douglas Bader. Let's move on to round number three. Round number three is the famous landmarks round, and this is an anagram round. Can you unscramble the anagrams and name this famous landmark in the country that it can be found in? You get two points if you can name both. And if you need more time, just pause the video. And the answers was Angkor Wat in Cambodia. Question 22. Unscramble the anagrams to reveal the name of a famous landmark and the country it can be found in. Again, two points if you can name both the landmark and the country. And the answer is the Sydney Opera House in Australia. Question 23. Can you unscramble the anagrams and name this famous landmark and the country that it can be found in? Again, two points if you can name both. And the answer is Machu Picchu in Peru. Question number 24. Again, unscramble the anagrams to reveal the famous landmark and the country it can be found in. Two points if you can name both. And the answer is Mont Saint-Michel in France. Question number 25. Unscramble the anagrams and name this famous landmark and the country that it can be found in. Again, two points if you can name both. And the answer is the Brandenburg Gate in Germany. Question number 26. Again, unscramble the anagrams to reveal the name of the famous landmark and the country that it can be found in. Two points if you can get both. And the answer is the Western Wall in Israel. Question number 27. Unscramble the anagrams and name the famous landmark and the country where it can be found. Again, two points if you can get both answers. And the answer is the Giant's Causeway in Northern Ireland. Question number 28. Unscramble the anagrams to reveal the famous landmark and the country it's found in. Two points again if you can name both answers. And the answer is La Sagrada Familia in Spain. Question number 29. And scramble the anagrams and name the famous landmark and the country that it's found.
And the answer is the Grand Palace in Thailand. And the final question of this round. And scramble the anagrams to name the famous landmark and the country where it can be found. Again, two points if you can name both. And the answer is the Patala Palace in Tibet. Let's move on to the final round. As ever, it's the general trivia round. And here comes the first question. Hansen is an American pop rock band from Tulsa, Oklahoma. But what was their first top 10 single in 1997? Was it Snowed In, Middle of Nowhere, or This Time? And the answer was Middle of Nowhere. Question 32. What disease was rife on pirate ships during the 15th and 16th century? Was it the plague? Was it scurvy? Or was it typhoid? And the answer was scurvy. Question number 33. What was the name of the Mafia crime boss who was the head of the feared Chicago outfit? Was it John Gotti, Lucky Luciano or Al Capone? And the answer was Al Capone. Question number 34. Amazon is one of the biggest e-commerce companies in the world. But what was the original company name? Was it Alakazam, Shazam, or Kadabra? And the answer was Kadabra. Question number 35. Which game studio produces the Red Dead Redemption series? Is it Rockstar Games, Ubisoft, or Activision? And the answer is Rockstar Games. Question number 36. Oriolin is a shade of what colour? Is it green, brown or yellow? And the answer is yellow. Question 37. Spotify is a popular music streaming platform but who is its most streamed artist throughout its history? Is it Beyonce, Drake or Taylor Swift? And the answer is Drake. Question number 38. Roald Amundsen was the first man to reach the South Pole. But which country was he from? Was he from Sweden, Finland or Norway? And the answer was Norway. Question number 39. Kratos is the main character in which video game series? Is it Dante's Inferno, God of War or Darksiders 2? And the answer was God of War. And the final question of this week's quiz, question 40. What is a group of pandas most commonly known as? Is it an embarrassment, an awkwardness, or a shyness? And the answer is an embarrassment. And that brings us to the end of this week's quiz. How did you do? Please leave your scores in the comments section below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified of all the latest quizzes. And by the way, if you enjoyed this quiz, I'm sure you'll like these. See you next time.